welcome to today's vlog. We don't have too much going on since it's like our summer has already started. So all the classes have stopped. There's no dance, there's no soccer, there's no uh, jujitsu or kickboxing. So I think we're gonna try to go to a different library um, and then maybe head to um, the Salado Creek or check out the park there. Just kind of hang out, um, hopefully stop by my parents, just hang out with them. I know they've been missing the kids. My husband is still sick. He is, what is this, since Sunday. So like, he's been sick for four days. Um, he worked yesterday and he was working today, but he said today he kind of feels worse than he did yesterday. So still not too sure what he has, but he's kind of keeping his distance. I've been cleaning the house like crazy, especially my room. Um, been disinfecting it like daily now. We are supposed to get super bad storms today. We haven't like put any claims or insurance claims in on the house yet because we haven't got our roof checked out yet and I didn't want to get the roof checked out yet until this, all the storms are like kind of done with. Um, so we'll see if we get any more damage today or tonight or like tomorrow morning. Hopefully not. Yeah, that's Hopefully. what we're gonna do today. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and start getting ready. I sent the kids to get ready. Uh, we'll see if they are. <laughs> Isaac is starting to get dressed but I need to brush the boys' teeth. I need to get make sure my daughter is like on track getting ready, and then I need to get ready myself. I haven't done an introduction on my vlog in a very long time, so figured I would go ahead and do that today. Um, if you are new here, if you're seeing this for the first time, hi, my name is Isabel Floriano. I'm a Christian mama to three littles. Well, I used to say three littles, but they're not really little anymore. My, my youngest is three, Mateo, and then I have Isaac, who is four. He's about to turn five. Um, and then I have Mia, and she is nine. I share day in the lives, I share homeschooling vlogs, um, birthday vlogs. We are a homeschooling family, we're a Christian family, um, we're also a military family. Um, but yeah, we're located in Central Texas. <laughs> this is so hard to film when he's running around like that. But we are located in Central Texas. Uh, if you're interested in any of that content, please feel free to subscribe. I would love it if you stick around and join us here. Um, and just kind of do life with us. Please feel free to comment. I would love to get to know you and if you have any questions, let me know. Yeah, let's go ahead and jump into today's video. really quick um, I just threw on a t-shirt and some oversized um, cheap shorts some blue jean shorts now all I have to do is I'm um, just gonna put my regular earrings that I always put on super simple um, I've always worn these I don't know why they're just simple to me and I'm kind of a simple person I don't like a lot of I don't like things that are too complicated so I'm like ah, this is enough <laughs> for me um, grab my rings Wash my face. I usually have my clip, but Teo likes to put like the big claw clip. He likes to put it on his arm and carry it around with him. I'm also supposed to do some balloons um, for a church because they're gonna have like a movie night, and um, I told him I'd help out like blowing up the balloons and setting those up and everything. So before I leave, I wanted to show you guys something that I got in the mail today. I got my package in. I got some new collagen from Bite Authority. A little thank you note here. So yeah, they sent me their collagen and I opted for I opted for a tropical punch. I really wanted to try theirs because they have so many different types of collagen. Um, so I'm really excited to try this and I wanted to try it with you guys to see how the taste is and how to see how quickly it dissolves. Um, it's non-GMO, gluten-free, dairy-free, no artificial colors. what it looks like. 
looks like all mixed in. It mixed fairly easy, um, especially if you have one of these little blenders. Um, it reminds me of like a lemonade color, but it definitely smells like fruit punch. So I'm gonna add some ice in here and then I'll taste it. I keep saying fruit punch, but the flavor is tropical punch, so it makes sense why it looks more like pineapple-ish, I guess. But it tastes really good. I love how refreshing that is. I'm gonna take this with me on the go, um, so I'm nice and refreshed as we're driving. Yeah, our first stop is gonna be the library to return a bunch of books, and then we're gonna go down the road to another library to check it out. Hopefully they have my daughter's um, Hopefully they have my daughter's book series, the one that she's reading into. I did want to say a big thank you to Vita Authority for sending me their collagen. If you guys want to try this for yourself, um, I'll put the link down in my description box below. I definitely recommend trying their Tropical Punch flavor. I really like it. It's different than like a fruit punch, but it's really refreshing, so I like that a lot. Um, they also had other flavors if you guys want to try that. Definitely check out their website. They have a lot of different health products for you guys to try. Be sure to check them out. Thank you guys again, but let's go ahead and head to the library. library and I dropped off all the books that we had been collecting <laughs> and then we came over here to the park um, I wanted to come to the park first as we looked at the clouds and the, it was really dark and there was kind of moving this way towards the park so. so let's go ahead and go to the park and if it starts to downpour we can run into the car and then just head to the other library that we we're gonna check out yeah and then maybe stop by my parents see what they're up to um, my dad mentioned that they also have a pool that he found in his attic so he said that maybe we'll be able to grab that so we can actually like have a pool uh, a windy yeah i have a pool not just a splash pad because my daughter mia she's nine she's kind of over the splash pad thing um we tried to fill up it was like a splash pad with a lip maybe with like six inches right worth of water um so we tried to fill it up as much as we could to make it kind of like a pool um but i think the kids want to like submerge themselves in some water but once the boys are done eating we're gonna go ahead and head to the park hopefully the rain holds off for a little bit so we can enjoy a little bit. about 4 40 um we came home just in time before the rain and the storm i'm about to get dinner ready but the rain has already started i can hear thunder but nothing too bad uh, my daughter and i we did see like a big cloud and like a like a downpour almost 
um, so we can see where it was raining and now that we see like it's getting a little darker here the rain is starting to pick up a little bit so I'm gonna go ahead and get dinner ready for the kids I'm gonna get them some rotisserie chicken um, some tortellinis from yesterday and then probably some carrots while I'm going to make dinner I'm going to sip on this um, this is like an Aldi equivalent to Olipop. It says there is trace amounts of alcohol on this one, 0.5%. So, I don't know. Take that as you may. I'm not sure. It's supposed to be root beer flavor. It tastes just like um, Olipop, honestly, but it's a more um, soda-y and... Um, I think I'm just kind of like searching for the notes of alcohol, but I don't, I don't taste it. But I'm not gonna let my kids try this one with me just because I don't want to risk it. <laughs> meals I'm probably not gonna finish it but it's okay this is mine and my husband's dinner his throat still hurts so hopefully this won't be a little this won't be too spicy for him but I get the uh, chicken tiki masala he also got it I think yeah looks the same so yeah we get that it comes with rice and it comes with like garnishes and stuff um, the best on a rainy day I think <laughs> Um, so far, like, this is my all-time favorite meal. You could order a naan to go with it, and it's super yummy. Um, I will say, I only eat half of mine because the second day leftovers are the best. It's more mild, um, and you can enjoy it more, I feel like, but, because the spices kind of go down, but still, favorite, best meal ever. I tried to give some to my brother. He was, like, starving, and I was like, oh, you gotta try this. It's my favorite meal ever. He was not impressed. He wasn't impressed. He didn't care for it. He's like, it's just chicken and rice, but it's not. It's so much better. This is it all put together. Like I said, I get half of everything, um, half of the naan, half of the rice, and half of the the, um, the chicken. But I'm going to save that for tomorrow, and I'm going to go ahead and enjoy this. You see that big cloud right there? That's what we're looking at. But we looked at the forecast. It's not going to get really, really bad for our area until midnight or like 11 or 12. Raining, wind, hail. We went ahead and ate dinner. Um, the storm calmed down. It's not even raining anymore. Um, but it is supposed to come back really bad later. So hopefully our power doesn't go out. But before it does, or before it has a chance to, I'm going to go ahead and blow up some balloons. Um, so I, I volunteer at my church in the children's ministry, and I love it there. I do the balloons in the children's ministry, and I kind of like, I'm, to, I'm supposed to change them up every month. I didn't do it last month. Well, I mean, I guess the month is still going on, but I do need to do it for June. I don't know what colors we're going to do. Our church is having a movie night, so we're going to do these balloons. They're like sea theme. Should turn out pretty cute. I'm going to try to blow them up. I think I'm going to, I mean, I guess I have to put them up tomorrow since that's when the thing is. <laughs> it's tomorrow. But I'm going to go ahead and start blowing them up now. Morning has broken. My windows are open. Want to feel the wind blow through my hair. Which way do I follow? What happens tomorrow? I turn to you and hope you can guide the way. Sometimes I give up, just wanna be on my own. Even in the darkest times, you give me hope. So.
so I'm done blowing up all of the balloons. I think the balloon theme is like a sea theme or like the theme for the night is a sea theme. So, um, but to help things go quickly when I'm installing, um, I think I'm going to go ahead and like set it up, like pre-set it up. That way I can just pop it out of the bag and um, attach it to the wall really quick. So... Yeah, so we'll see how that goes, but I, I kind of have a vision of how I want it. We'll see if it goes how I expect it to go. Is there so much beauty under your heaven? And I'm grateful every day. Sometimes I give up, just want to be on my own. Mm -hmm. Even in the darkest times, you give me hope. All right, so I kind of like pre-assembled it um, I obviously I, I want a wide base so I'm gonna connect these there and I still have like extras I will show you guys how it comes together tomorrow that'll be it for today's video thank you guys so much for stopping by and hanging out with us I hope you enjoyed it if you did please give it a big like it really helps out my channel if you guys are needing prayer for any reason for anything please leave a comment down below or you can dm me on my instagram I usually leave the handle here somewhere on the screen but thank you again and I will see you in the next one bye